consider yourself to be a Sacramento slash Vacaville band? Is that where you came from? Like if somebody, so, so how often do you go back there? Um, and when you go there, are you able to enjoy yourself or is it like paparazzi central where you kind of have to, you know, how are you able to enjoy your hometown? Um, I got a lot of love for Sacramento. I haven't, I honestly, I haven't spent much time in Vacaville. Mm -hmm. I got the, the fuck out of there real quick. <laughs> um, but, but anytime I'm passing through, I'm like, you know, I gotta get a burrito or like a taco or right. something. Um, where is it going Vacaville? Where? Yeah. Well, back in the day it was Marillo's and, and, uh, what's the other place? I just went blank. Uh. Where's your favorite place to get a burrito in Sacramento? I like La Granacha on 16th. Oh, uh, what's the one that we always go to on 16th? Oh, uh, well, we, we go to... Tres Hermanos? Yeah, we love Tres Hermanos. Yeah. 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 To sit down. Dude, those margaritas, man, they oh. <laughs> sneak up on you. Yep. Yeah, no. It's, uh, I got a lot of love for downtown Sacramento, you know. I like it. We we have our studio there, and when and when we spent time down there, like going and hanging out with all our friends, going to uh, Ace of Spades and watching shows, that was like a really inspiring for us to be creative and make a record and do all that stuff down there. It's cool. It's nice. It's coming up. Great food. Great people. Yeah, great. You know, it like yeah, yeah, that whole street's coming up. You know, it's like the scene's coming back. So it's good. Yes. I mean, back in the day, you know, we I miss like the the. Do you remember like. Bojangles days. Oh my god, I went to my first rave there. <laughs> you know what I'm the press club, yeah, all yeah, that stuff. I yeah, mean, yeah. it's dope, man. That is awesome. Bands, you know, like Deftones, Far, um, Kaya. Yeah, Kaya, Cake. I, wow, all Cake. The, I mean, all these yeah. amazing bands that have just, I mean, you know, some that are still doing it, some that are, you know, not, but. Yeah. A really, a really good, inspiring place to like, come from. And they, yeah, die trying. They definitely left an impact, you know, and they, they helped kind of pave the way to show that you can get out of Sacramento. You have to have that drive and that motivation, you know. It's yeah. just all in, in what you want. You got to go for it. Yeah. So I know that you guys do a lot of interviews and that you're in media a lot of times. Have you ever found that? when you say something if it gets twisted or maybe All the time. <laughs> okay so my question to that is what do you do do you react and respond or do you just let it go and not even give any energy to it it depends on how bad it is i mean <laughs> one of the last things jacoby was doing an interview and he'll just say shit off the top of his head and, and he said something like uh he, he got herpes or something from a yeah, kissing his I uncle but you were getting there. I, no, I did it subliminally. <laughs> that's that's like one of the more recent ones for, that I, I can remember. That it was just like we were like, dude, really? Like, like because people were, it, it became like a I don't even you know it wasn't like it wasn't like a e e news network thing, but it was like, really, dude? Like, and we're you know, clips on like uh, you know Loudwire or something, whatever. And it was just like, oh. But you know, <laughs> like if you give it to them, they're gonna take it, yeah, yeah, and run with it, and so, you know. But at the same time, you know, he's he he lets it go, good. but uh, which is good because you can't like stew on dumbass shit like that, like, you know. No. Yeah, it just gets kind of awkward though when you're like, I didn't really mean it that way. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Well, and he it's. Was kidding, by the way. He was yeah. kidding. He was yeah. kidding. Do you guys have anything juicy for us that we can twist? <laughs> 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 Do you guys want to come out of the closet like Eminem did on the interview? Oh, yeah. <laughs> that was really? it was it was a joke, but oh you haven't seen I it? Know. Oh it's hilarious. Oh, he's he's I can tell you that he, he he secretly wishes that we were all by so that on on tour, you know, we could I mean, just man, you know. Tony or Eminem? Tony. Oh, okay. I was like, it's a pretty good idea. I mean, if it it would make you know Yeah, we're we're you know, we're all married and, and it's like we're we're on tour for like months at a time, you know. It's like. Is it really cheating? My whole thing would just be like, how cool, how cool would that be if you were like you? Yeah. Just come off stage, suck each other off. Be like, I'm all good now. I'm just kidding. I'm just now nah, that would. You gonna finish me off, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Twist that one up. Yeah, yeah we're always gonna get twisted. That's already twisted up. So, if you were by, would it only be with each other, or do you have any man crushes? 
like anybody like celebrity Sorry, that you, but you look at him and you're like oh man I wish I was bi because he's so hot uh, I really don't ever wish I was but uh, <laughs> it, was, it was a joke I, mean, I know I'm just I, kidding but I, I don't uh, hey there's nothing wrong with finding other men attractive no, that makes you confident mean, in your sexuality I was, I was getting there I, I think there are definitely some freaking handsome dudes out there I mean how can you you know look at a guy and just go if he well, if he is Dude, all the Rob Lowe's on those right? commercials. On those, <laughs> yes, concur. Um, no, that guy never ages. No. No, but yeah, I can appreciate a good-looking dude, but I'm not going to go. Tony used to, he used to jump in my bunk all the time. <laughs> and, uh, you know, <laughs> happy <laughs> drunk, happy drunk bunk happy, jumping. Happy, happy, and I'd always like, be like, Tony, no. You're all, your beard is scratching me. <laughs> that's about Aww. the extent of that. Yeah. That's the extent. There's nothing wrong with spooning a friend. Yeah. Nothing wrong with that. Actually, I mean, it was probably we were, forced, like, me and him were we were at a festival. We were we were, we were hanging out, just kind of cuddling in a in a hammock, if you will, sharing a bottle. No, of no, uh, sharing a bottle oh, yeah, of vodka. Yeah, yeah. It was were, a hammock. You were in the. Hammock. I, I was in the hammock. I saw him in the hammock, and, and he saw he ran and jumped into the hammock with me. And we didn't break. It didn't break. And we were you know having so he just stayed. Yeah, luckily we didn't fall out. We were just sitting there drinking our drinks, and oh, this girl wa- this girl walks by and she goes cute and Tony's all it's cool we're in the same band <laughs> you know she's all oh alright yeah like nothing carry on carry on exactly carry on that's awesome I want to talk about uh, lovers or lunatics I know that that's his clothing line are you guys involved in it at all okay uh, so Kobe and uh, a friend of his named Jeff and uh, he mm-hmm. was from Michigan Okay. That's something that they they don't know. So do you guys get hit up often by strangers, clothing companies, brands that say, can you please wear my shirt on stage? Or what will it take for you to wear my stuff while you're performing? Does that happen often as musicians? Not as much as it used to. We used to. Mm -hmm. Yeah. And we took all that stuff. (laughs) We were like, yeah, we'll wear it. (laughs) Like early 90s, like, you know, that stuff. Adidas, Dickies, uh, Nikes, DVS, and all that stuff, and like all the skater wear. But um, companies were just. I wish that would happen now, actually, but because, man, I just. I don't know. I got expensive taste now. I don't know. It's so (laughs) good. All Saints, come on, give us some some free shit. (laughs) All Saints. You hear that? That's what they want. That's awesome. They have great <laughs> women uh, wear too. Yeah. Well, I see. I like all this weird. Cra- I got into like yeah. weird fashion forward shit, and like I'm like, damn, I love that. How much is that? And then like two thousand dollars. That's fucking retarded. Yeah. If I what? wear that on stage, like, it's gonna get sweaty, and it's gonna. Like, that's a nice jacket week. and all, but it ain't that nice. Oh, that's a freaking yeah. car. Like, yeah. I mean, it's a, a whip, well, but it's a car. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> would never do that. So no. if any of you really expensive clothing companies want to give us some weird shit, and there it is, they'll rock it. You just gotta we, send it. We, we rocked a lot of uh, Royal Underground, Nikki and uh, Nikki Six's line mm-hmm. with our friend Kelly Gray. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that was, they make made some good stuff. I don't know know what they're doing right now. Actually, I gotta hmm. gotta hit them up. Kind of that. Kind of yeah. That. All right, so let's talk about. We talked about the album. We talked about everything. 2015. You've got Rock on the Range, and what else can we expect to see from you guys this year? All of it. Yeah, we're. Everything. I mean, no, like seriously, we're we're yeah. doing all, like anything you could possibly imagine. We're gonna do aftershock. We're gonna do rock on the range. We're gonna do a show in our hometown. You're gonna hear about it really soon. It's gonna be really fun, and uh, we'll have lots of surprises for you on that right. occasion. And we're gonna celebrate, you know, 15 years of our first record in Fest. Um, we're going. We're, we're leaving for Australia, so it's like we're gonna go to Australia. We're gonna do a big tour in Europe, the UK, Russia. I mean, worldwide Good touring. Shit. Yeah, Good and uh, Tons of radio. we're shooting a we're shooting a video mm-hmm. uh, for Gravity. I don't think. We, yeah, okay, uh, we can say with oh. Maria Brink. Yeah, with Maria. Nice. Quite, quite possible. Nice. It's quite possible yeah. she might make a cameo. I don't know if I'm supposed to say that, but I said yeah, it, so yeah, whatever. Chaos. 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 Capital chaos. Capital chaos. Capital chaos TV. Motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs>